An awesome thing about going on these Ontario experiences is that I get to take, take advantage of nature's grocery store. Last year I shot a really nice moose. This trip, I've got moose burgers. Moose is an awesome meat. You do not want to ruin it when you're, when you're making moose burgers. I've got this recipe you are not going to want to miss. Get a piece of paper and a pencil and write this down. Here are all the ingredients you'll need. Salt. Moose makes the best burger hands down. The natural flavor of it is so good. You don't really even need salt. I add a little bit just for a little bit of extra flavor. Actually, this has got, this has got, uh, it's not just salt. It's, uh, it's got a little bit of seasoning to it too. Just, just to make it a little bit better. It's tough to beat alone, but sometimes it's good to add just a little bit. And these are really lean burgers. So I actually put it on some foil too, so it doesn't fall apart. Now with moose burger, you do not want to overcook it. With any wild game like a venison or a moose or a bear, it doesn't have a lot of fat in it like a, a beef or a pork. So don't overcook it because it gets tough and it's not nearly as good. So I usually go two and a half minutes per side. You know, I flip it and then I usually go to the touch so you can feel it kind of bounce a little bit. You know the meat is done. 